Hi, this is the CFX355 litre fridge freezer from Dometi. A really good fridge, quite a large one, ideal for large groups of extended touring, so let's check it out. It. Hi, I'm Kevin from Snowy's Outdoors. This is the CFX355 litre fridge freezer. A really big fridge, ideal for long distance touring or family groups. Let's open up and have a look inside. So as you can see inside the fridge, it's a nice big capacity fridge. Fairly deep tray there with a shelf here which sits on top of the compressor. The basket is removable and of course it has a removable divider as well in the basket. So I can easily take that out. It's got CFC free insulation in the walls and the element runs all the way around the outside for the fridge freezer. You've got a bung in the bottom that you can easily take out for cleaning and an LED light just here to see when it's dark. I'll just pop this basket back in again. Now it holds 85 cans of drink and quite easily will accommodate tall bottles. There's a bottle of wine and a 1.25 Coke. Now while it's up, I'll just show you how easy it is to remove the lid. All you have to do is just bend the lid all the way back. It comes off quite easily. You've got a couple of stainless steel hinges both sides and stainless steel pins just down there. To put the lid back on again, you simply slot it back over the top of the pins. Give it a decent bump on with each of your hand. You shut it down and she's ready to go. Now outside you have an exo-frame of polypropylene on the edges of the ends of the fridge you've got cast aluminium handles which are spring-loaded and very strong. The fridge has got a weight of 20.4 kilos. Its dimensions are 72 centimeters long, you've got 45.5 centimeters wide and you've got a height of 48 centimeters. Okay so let's have a look at this end here. Inside here you've got the Dometic compressor. It has a current draw approximately 1.1 uh, amps per hour and a maximum draw of 8.7. You've got two plugs here, one of 240 volt and the other one of 12 volt. The 12 volt plug goes in quite easily, just plug it straight in that way. And of course the 240 volt plug, it goes in just as easy in that way there. And on the end of the 12 volt plug, of course you have a little fuse inside there, so if you blow a fuse, very easy, just unscrew the end, take it out, put another fuse in, and once again you're ready to go. Okay, so let's now have a look at the other end of the fridge, where the control panel is. Firstly, we've got a little USB port there, rated at 2 amps, ideal for charging your phone or whatever. Over here you've got the temperature of the fridge, now it's currently set at 7 degrees. If you want to change it, just make sure you're on the set temperature. Hit OK again, and you can actually go down or up in temperature. This fridge will run between 10 degrees Celsius and minus 22. Once you've got the right temperature, hit OK, it'll flash and go back to the main menu. If you drop it down, the next one you've got battery protection, which I'll talk about later. You've also got the advantage of having this fridge running on either Bluetooth or Wi-Fi, depending on what you want to do. And of course, that's a free app you get from the Dometic website. Okay, now I just want to quickly explain to you about the battery protection system. You've got three levels, low, medium and high. At low protection, that means the fridge will run down to a lower voltage in the battery before it cuts out. High protection means it'll run to a much higher voltage before it cuts out. That's why it protects your starter motor of your car and you'll be able to start the car the next day. Medium will depend on how old the battery is and its capacity. Depending on what you want to do, that's where you can set it to. Now that's all I can tell you about the CFX3 fridge freezer from Dometic. If you have any more queries, go to our website at snowies.com.au where you'll find the lowest prices every day. So we're gonna see some more of this, subscribe up here. If you have any questions, leave a comment down here. If you wanna check out any more videos, have a look over here.